<laughs> so fast. Annyeong everyone, this is Ju from Soju Cars and this is the BYD SEAL and it is a performance model which costs about 2.5 million. The real price will be revealed on October 25 when you are watching this video. Thank you again for watching this video. In our channel we say, 시작! To start off, you do get two keys. Number one, the physical key. Number two, you get a card key where you can easily tap here or you can just use your smart key and press the button here so you can enter your vehicle. From the front, it looks very slick. And here, that looks like whiskers. But for me, I think since this is a seal, it's like a seal doing like that, honk, honk, honk. BYD logo, front camera, a very sporty piano black lower chin. The seal is quite low, about 120 something minimum ground clearance. You have to be careful in this thing. Thank God we have a front camera. It will hit this area, so be careful. Functional, sleek, stylish, and modern. In this corner, functional vents, dotted, slotted disc braking system which is performance mind you this is a full ev with a 235 45r19s very grippy tires i tried driving it earlier you'll be surprised how fast and this is how the seal looks like with the lights on this is the park light the headlight then high beam hazard and this is the back park light brake hazard reverse fog lamp and since we are here in front i want to show you the front just have to pull the lever twice then it will go up this way we have double byds open the cover well padded you can have a lot of macbook pros here like maybe seven or eight of them it's good that we have a functional front and for you to close just uh, about 12 inches and drop because if you don't put proper force, you'll have to go and open it again and do it again. So do it hard on your first try. BYD is targeting executives, those young entrepreneurs that want luxury, but also performance. This car can do everything. It saves environment. It performs well on the track, on the road. It has all the great amenities. You name it, this has it. Their main competitors are like Camry Hybrid, BMW 3 Series 318i, and the Lexus IS300h. BYD, very clean, like a duck tail here, very smooth. There's a button here, there's a camera here, the diffuser, rear, fog lamp, sensors all around, power tailgate, the BYD charger, and the BYD accessories, the subwoofer, then under here, more compartments, a little bigger than what you have in front. And you can also further expand the cargo space by folding the second row. BYD Seal 3.8S. It means it can do 0 to 100. It's just 3.8 seconds. 82.5 kilowatt hour capacity of the battery. 580 kilometers in full charge. AC, DC, quick charge, 150 kilowatt of DC charging capable. So you can bring it to like Ayala Mall charging stations, then you can fully utilize that. Euro NCAP 5 star rating in 2023. The cell to body platform. So meaning instead of attaching the cell to the body, it means the battery pack, it is actually the flooring of the seal and it's very well sealed, no pun intended. Since this is a performance model, its weight distribution is important. 50-50 ratio weight distribution, which is perfect. The BYD seal has four color lineup, Arctic blue, Aurora white, Cosmo black, and Atlantis gray. The moment I get in, the seat actually moves away so I can get inside easily. And that's like one of the things that just makes the car more premium. I can choose to put the phone here to charge or on the other side to charge. So they didn't go tipid mode, they left it on both sides. Gear selector. So R and D, it feels like a Volvo. Steering wheel design actually similar with the other models. The interior, 
It's different because it has suede here. Panoramic sunroof. It is not the, the panoramic sunroof that you can close. All these light things, they look like as if they come from Mercedes-Benz, you know. They have very good quality, auto dimming room mirror, heads up display, digital screens. This is like more than 15 inch that goes just rotating like they've never rotated before. You can easily press this and take a look at 360 view in any speed. So even though you're going probably 200, you can still see what's happening just to be safe, you know, just to be safe. Airbags are all around the vehicle. The seat is extremely comfortable. They are bucket seats, cooled, heated, you name it. This is going to hold you very well in the corners because number one, it is just hogging me. Audio system, Dynaudio. This is more popular in Europe, but now we have it here. Look at this. All these are padded, just like Ferrari. It's big space. And the aircon is nice, right? But it's not the usual, the air vent. You cannot control it manually, but you can control it here on the screen. And you can also have swing mode. It also has cabin filtration system. All these parts are not just the ordinary plastic. Even this door, everything just looks premium and also imported and expensive. And what I find cool, the child lock lock for the rear. Auto brake hold, blind spot warning, drive mode, the start button, auto for the aircon and the blower. And the volume is like the Mercedes-Benz, the rotary type, very, very convenient. Two cup holders. You can also open this up. And this is how the key looks like, BYD. Almost looking like a Porsche. More storage here, more charge ports there. Tilt and telescopic. Automatic lighting system, rain sensing wiper. The sun visor has vanity lights and mirror. And it just covers like sacto. You don't need to have it extend. I wish it had a sunglass case. It says here NFC. This is where you can also tap your card so just in case the, the car goes off because like you've been idle for the longest time, you just tap it, then you can restart your BYD seal. And we don't have a grab handle here. This is how much Chinese cars have come and they really excite everybody. They are now world class. They are like being number one, beating Tesla and all that. So there's a reason for that. Really spacious here. Amazingly spacious and it just becomes more spacious because of this sunroof, panoramic sunroof, it's one piece of glass. And all this, look at the details, these pouches, they are all divided, everything, it just maximizes use of space, material, also the leather feels very premium and just look at this gloss area, usually in performance cars you have this, like if you had a BYD here that's illuminating that it will be perfect. Some places for like hooks for your clothes, grab handle, the lights are just amazing. Everything, even the ambient light here on the second row. Hi BYD. Please open ambient light setting. Ooh. Air vents, a place for maybe a phone, and then two charge port, one type A, one type C. And what we like is the floor, which is flat, extremely flat cup holders really comfortable soft supple leather and the seat even the headrest is not the cheap one it actually feels very good soft and also well designed although i must admit the rear glass is very narrow normally in a performance car you will probably suffer a little on normal practical things but this one Considering the speed and everything, it is just so practical. Even a little window there. Please do like and subscribe. Thank you. Sport mode. Three, two, one. Oh my God. In just 3.8 seconds. Oh my God. It's so fast. The word quick is not even justified. This is, oh my God, it's a rocket ship. Like to the point that you might not want to give this car to someone who's not responsible enough to 
be responsible of this power. Oh my God. Oh my goodness, it's, it's crazy fast. Oh my God. How can this car be this fast? It's not like out of control, but it's crazy fast. Oh my gosh. Did you see me move around? I'm not even kidding. It's oh. everything just flying around. Oh my goodness. How can this be? How can this be this quick? So like me trying to point out 530 PS and uh, 670 Newton, it's not even needed. Like I've driven the Zikr 001. This one is nothing compared to that. This has about a 2.1 ton weight for the car, but it doesn't feel that way. Also the braking, the acceleration and the turning. It's very agile. And you feel flat on the floor. You feel flat on the ground. Fairly a low car. Now I know why it has to be that. Oh, look. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. You see, it just goes and goes and goes. But the more I do it, I am adjusting to it. Because earlier when I did the pull, I felt, you know, my face being sucked in. So make sure you breathe. You breathe, you have to breathe. Okay, you have to breathe. And that's what I think of the BYD seal. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please do hit that like button and subscribe if you found this video helpful. With that, I'll see you in the next video. Merry dreams come true, everyone. Bye.